Yesterday, I made a video entitled, T.I. doesn't want to be accountable for his son's pookie behavior in Atlanta. And of course, I got a lot of comments that supported my idea in the video. And my idea in the video was simply, T.I. is responsible for his son's behavior because his son is trying to be just like him based on the environment T.I. set for the child. However, many of you guys disagreed and I'm gonna just let you know some of these comments pass by here as Dima puts them on the screen. And, and what I heard were a lot of excuses. Oh, well, he did the best he could for the kid. It's the kid's own choice. Okay, let's use that argument for today's podcast. Let's, 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 let's change genders here, if we will. Let's create T.I., no disrespect for him. Let's substitute him for a single mom, all right? Or a woman who's married to a Pookie and Ray Ray daddy. And the son has the same problem. Well, know what y'all gonna do? Y'all going to come after that woman. Oh, hell no. See, she, she has like, she don't want to be accountable. Look how she act on social media. Look at her weaves. Look at those booty shorts she wear. She always starting it up. Oh, hell no. No wonder why the kids turn out like that. Look at her. She's a straggle daggle. This is what y'all are going to say about that woman. This is what you black men are going to say. Okay. But if you don't think that I'm right about T.I., all you got to do is look at his reality show. Look at T.I.'s reality show. Okay. What did you see on T.I. Tiny, The Family Hustle? Want to know what these people are? They are ghetto. Ghetto. They got money, but they're ghetto. Okay? He served a 12-month prison sentence. What was the charge? Guns? Dr some Drugs? All of this was when the kid was born. He saw his father acting a goddamn fool, rap beefs, everything else. Okay? Would you want your kid, would you want T.I. and Tiny raising your kid? Hell to the no. No, they might be married, but T.I. and Tiny are liberal parents. They don't have no strong infrastructure for kids to be successful. But y'all want to say the kid make the same choice. Okay, well then we can say the same thing then for every woman in the black community that produces Pookies and Ray Rays. Because I'm going to tell you what the same thing that King is doing. He's doing the same thing. Guess what? In the 50s and 60s and 70s, Let's go back to the 70s. Many of y'all don't understand that many people who started cripping in blood in LA came from two parent homes. Y'all don't know that, do y'all? Y'all thought it was just a single moms out there producing these pookies and rare rays? No, many of the folks that y'all like that started crip sets in LA, pyru sets, or later known as blood sets in LA, came from two parent homes. But y'all don't want to take the Oh, well, you know, well, he, you, well, well, he came from two parent home. He did it on his own. No, they saw their daddy being a drunk sometimes. Daddy beating on the mama sometimes. Father not having any kind of damn sense. Not being there, not investing in his kids. And I noticed something. When it's T.I., y'all don't want to, y'all don't want to blame him, right? And here's the reason why. Because some of y'all is like that. Some of y'all kids, y'all might not want to comment it. Y'all kids is having bad issues. I saw one brother who unfortunately his son died about three to four weeks ago. I won't even mention the city. And the brother was in a lot of sorrow, but I looked at the, the, the young man's profile. And of course I saw a lot of gang affiliation signs being thrown. I saw pants sagging off the behind. And I thought to myself, how did this young man end up like this? This is your son, right? You don't want to take an accountability for your son ended up like that? Because women got to take accountability for their kids acting like that, right? Because what you going to say? Well, you raised them. You raised them. You did this to them. Y'all going to say that, right? This is what y'all say when it's black women. But when it's black men who raise kids who are not productive, y'all don't want to be blamed for that. Hell no. We're going to put the blame where it needs to be. T.I. founded the Trap Museum. What is trap rap about, guys? What is trap music? We you know what trapping is? It's a down soft terminology. What is trapping? It's about dope, selling drugs. God forbid. You wanna know what crack cocaine did to the black community? It focuses on drugs and urban violence. This Negro makes a trap museum and you gonna tell me that this is a good father for somebody? Get out of here. Get out of my face. Shut up. Because if any black woman started a Tatiana museum, a twerk museum, if the lady died, y'all will be dragging her in her death. 
You would talk about her, her family. You would talk about everything she did. Let's look, look at Amber Rose, the slut walk. Okay, look, let's talk about that. Amber Rose has never been able to, 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 to um, live that down still. And I get it. In my opinion, it makes a bad stereotype of certain women Hold who up. participated in that. But you guys called that out. Fair enough. Okay, I, I mean, whatever. Let her do her thing. But I wouldn't want my wife or daughter participating in a slut walk. Why? Because I don't want nobody calling my daughter or a young lady that I know a slut. I'm going to have a problem with that. But now with the Trap Museum and T.I. who influenced that and a lot of stuff that you see in hip hop right now, a lot of these Chicago rappers, go ask them who were 600 Breezy, who they look up to. T.I. T.I. is a damn good rapper, one of the greatest to ever do it. You will get no argument with me. I like T.I., but we're going to call him out on the BS though. Because T.I. want to have a lot of issues about violence in Atlanta and you out of town and bringing this out. N Negro, look at your music. You think his son wasn't sitting there listening to that? And that because T.I. had a few dollars and they lived in a better neighborhood, he wasn't going to turn out like he did? T.I. had everything to do with how his kid turned out. Not if it was something different, his mama was not tiny, she was an attorney, and his dad was a doctor and he turned out, then I would have more of an issue with that. But look at all T.I.'s allegations. Running women with his wife, threesomes and stuff. You think the kids ain't there watching that? Or being around that energy? And the reason why he got that energy is because his daddy gave him that energy. He learned from his parents. A lot of the stuff that your kids be become, we learned it from our parents. Whether that's in business or mismanaging money, bad habits or good habits. We learn it from our family. That's why the Bible says, train up a child in the way he should grow. And when he gets old, older, he shall not depart from it. Meaning that if the child has some mistakes along the way, he will come back to that good training. But the problem is King don't have no good training. And if it's black women, you guys are going to jump all over them. I will not let black men be dishonest on my show. No, you're not going to just call it out because some of y'all are Pookie and Ray Ray daddies. Some of y'all are married and your wife is y'all both Pookisha and Pookie together. Yes, you are. And your kids are terrorizing everything they touch. Some of y'all. Okay. And we're not going to say they're not terrorizing because y'all both, 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 both married. You didn't lay nothing out for the kids to follow. That's why they act like that. And the same thing here going on with T.I. Pookie and Pookisha. I don't care how much you like. Every time we, we, we mention future, you guys go out here. And this is not all black men, but some of you black men. You guys go out here and you threaten. You, you want to fight somebody all of a sudden in the comments. Oh, not future. Y'all get angry. Nick Kenny, y'all get angry. Oh, but if it's a black woman doing this, y'all want to. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's face the Pookieism. But guys, what do you think? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again. With another episode of the celebrity junk i already appreciate you for all that you do subscribe to the bell check out the first comment at the top and as you know the buffoon remains all time high i'm out